We're going to take a look at the basic site first and the context and your circulation and parking. I mean, he said he would want something similar to this. And, and probably since we might remove the front parking, more people will park back here. And this will look like more of a main entrance, too. So. When I first met uh, Jim Berjan, who's the director of planning for the city of Arlington, we talked about how wonderful it was to give students an opportunity to have hands-on experiences and how helpful that could be to a community. We came to realize that one of the great things that could happen in Arlington would be to have literally a storefront that had planning and urban design going on. Working a projects here, of course, we have real clients, real needs. So when we do any design or even draw a line or the dimensions of anything, we need to make sure it works. We carry a very great responsibility. So the scope of our project is mainly the site, right? Mainly look at the exterior, see how the building circulation mm -hmm. and the traffic pattern and everything is working mm -hmm. right now. Then the first step is definitely site visit. We'll have to do a pretty extensive one. Well, before doing this site visit mm -hmm. is to look at all the drawing nice. first. Plus, actually around the entire yeah. block, so yeah, it'll be quite a bit of stuff. Plus, if we can go inside, that's yeah. also yeah. important. This experience for them is invaluable. You're encouraged to be really creative in school, and that's good. But oftentimes, when you get out into the real world, there are lots of parameters that you have to work within. And so the types of projects we work on here kind of give them um, an opportunity to see how that really actually happens. It's allowed us to go beyond a single project in, in assisting and seeing the results of that student labor. By doing things like this uh, Urban Design Center, we're giving a lot of students a lot of opportunities. And getting to work on certain projects is really exciting because it is the heart of the city. And as a student, you actually can draw something out and show it to the public uh, makes me very happy or excited um, about the project. We have had incredibly positive feedback from everyone that we've worked with. You know, we, we work with such a broad variety of clients, so that's kind of unique that we get that consistent positive feedback. The center kind of represents the next frontier in terms of what what cities can do, what schools can do, what the different professions can do. There's a lot of collaboration and at this point a lot of overlap. And so I think um, cities are starting to realize this. Um, UTA is definitely realizing that and grasping onto the benefits that come from having students work in an environment like this. We all would like to experience what we think our job for the next 40 years is going to be like and uh, that gives them an opportunity that typically students never have.